Guillaume is what time is scripts. Let's go! Hey everyone, Thornton Smash here, and today we're going to be talking about a bug and glitch that is impacting a ton of Apex Legends players, where all their stats and the RP that they've gained in ranked keep getting reset, and what may be causing that, because it seems very familiar to an issue we've seen in the past. Along with that, Chinatown Market has rebranded officially, and there's some news on these skins that will be coming, so we'll cover that as well. Let's dive into the RP issue. Over the weekend, there has been a massive Apex Legends bug that has been resetting players' progress. And as you can see here, this player reached gold, but then when they quit or reset their game, they were knocked down to silver one, and then back down to silver two, losing all the RP that they had gained. And it's not only an issue for ranked, a player here was complaining that they reached level 494 10 different times, the progress in their battle pass got rolled back, and their kills and damages didn't count either. I've had multiple people reach out to me saying they dropped the 20 bomb and now nothing is counting on their accounts. You can even see an example of it live in action right here where a Apex Predator has 13,023 RP. They simply go to the lobby, load back in, and they have automatically just lost RP even though they haven't played a match or done anything at all. From what I've seen and heard, this seems to only be impacting primarily PlayStation players, and this reminds me of something very familiar we had not too long ago. On April 6th, Apex Legends had a bug that caused players to lose all progress, including their skins and whatever cosmetics they owned. Ultimately, the problem was boiled down to a database shard which had been contributing to the recent progression issues for PlayStation players, which is eerily similar to what we are seeing exactly right now with progression issues. It's even impacting the same player base, the PlayStation users. And the end solution to all this was players who were affected had their progress restored from a backup from a earlier time frame, which unfortunately means that if this is the same issue we're seeing right now, any progress you made up over the weekend still won't be reverted to what you should be. Respawn hasn't officially stated what the issue is or what's causing it. However, Respawn Pav did say that he shared the issue with the team and they are looking into it. Hopefully we hear something back soon and it isn't something where players' progress will not be able to be restored from what they've done over the weekend. Moving into the Chinatown Market skins, which will no longer be called that. They are the Market skins. They have officially rebranded on August 15th as I went over in an earlier video. They were asked when the market skins would be coming to apex and they let us know that it would be soon i would expect sometime in september but it could be before then or it could be a little after that here are these skins before they rebranded i would expect something very similar to this just with some logo changes the skins were data mined by shrug tall and as you can see we were supposed to get a wraith legendary skin called ringside with a bobblehead charm we were going to get a mirage swordplay banner frame with the nightcrawler skin and a punching bag epic charm the lifeline was going to get a temperature rising banner frame, a mic check legendary lifeline skin, and a DOC epic charm. And Bloodhound was to receive the Sundown Desperado legendary skin and the Lowrider legendary flatline skin. That's going to be the information about the Market Town skins, hopefully coming to Apex Legends very soon. Along with that, hopefully they fix the impacting issues for PlayStation players with their accounts not counting, and we see a fix for that very soon if they haven't done it already. And until next time, Legends, keep slaying in the Outlands, and I'll see you out there.